35-year-old man is going to take a little boy and stay with him for 30 days and take another boy and stay with him for five days in a room and never leave the room. How many of you out there are 35 years old? How many men are out there? How many would take little kids and do that that are 9, 10, 11 years old? I love my brother, but it's wrong. I don't want to see these kids hurt. Latoya Jackson live in our studio. Elizabeth Taylor has stood by your brother in a way some would say you have not. Do you think she is being a hypocrite? When this first happened, Geraldo, people should stop and really think. The first person to Michael's aid was Elizabeth Taylor. If you stop and think, Michael should have called my parents. He should have called my mother. She should have been there. However, he didn't. He called Elizabeth Taylor. Now, I just left Europe and I left the Alps. And there are lots of friends there that I had that lived there. Elizabeth also lives there. And a lot of people there are doing a lot of talk and they're doing a lot of whispering from what Elizabeth is telling them and what she's talking about and what she's saying. Now, she's saying to them that what LaToya said about the million dollars is not true. She goes, I know for a fact that Michael has paid each one of his little boys $200,000 and not a million dollars. And this is what she's going around telling everybody. Now, I feel if she's a friend, she shouldn't say anything. Don't do that behind his back. Do you, LaToya Jackson, charge that Elizabeth Taylor is speaking out of both sides of her mouth when it comes to your brother Michael? From what the people are saying there, from what everybody's saying, yes, she is. Doesn't it sound logical to you that that's what she's doing? I asked the question, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Michael mentioned the skin disorder, the vitiligo that became famous, actually, after his Oprah interview. Does your brother, to your knowledge, have vitiligo? To my knowledge, I've never known of a skin disease in my family. Are you saying that your brother is lying about having a skin disorder? I'm saying I've never known of a skin disorder in my family whatsoever. Okay. Now, you and Michael seem to have very similar complexions. 